uh, late General Andrew Azazi has been dismissed from the armed forces. Lieutenant Colonel Robert Ahamwa was convicted by a general court martial proceeding in Lagos on a four count charge of suggesting to execute a sand filling project for the Bielsa state government for 150 million naira back in 2011. Presiding Judge Brigadier General Edward Nze sentenced him to seven years in prison, subject to the approval of the army hierarchy. With the assistance of the military police in collaboration with the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, the accused officer is to return over 142 million naira to the Bielsa state government. It's a, a very serious case. It borders on national security. It borders on the type of thing that the chief of army staff, this very chief of army staff, don't like. In discipline, especially when it comes to fraud, 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 he don't like it. He don't like hearing about fraud. He wants an army that we will have integrity. So that's why this one is even very bad. But all the same, the court just did its duty. It's left for the uh, appropriate superior authority to confirm. They can even change. It is uh, left for them. Whatever they say is what will be effective. For now, he will wait until that confirmation comes. As far as he's waiting for the confirmation, he's still in the Nigerian army. After the confirmation by the appropriate superior authority, if they confirm jail time for him, automatically he's no more in Nigerian army. Because you may you go to prison, you're ex-convict. Ex-convicts don't serve in Nigerian army.